quick demo of the online version of PowerSheet AI, AI-powered Excel and Guided BI, a Power Query alternative. Features, artificial intelligence, AI data transformations, fuzzy dedupe and lookup, selection reports, saved views, calculated columns, smart formatting, fuzzy compare, merge, and reconcile, always replace, Excel content add-in and online platform, rich pivot tables, find numeric combinations. Not everything is going to be demoed in this video, but you'll get a little taste. This screenshot is the Excel version. This video is really dedicated to the online version. A lot of the features are going to overlap and are going to be inside of the Excel version, but this is a preview of what the Excel version will look like with some of the nice features with the uh, pivot table and the special structures and ways of filtering that go way beyond what is available inside of Excel. Here's the combinations example. In this case, you have nine numbers, positives and negatives, that total another number. So you have, in this application, you're finding what combinations of payments and invoices total a balance, and two of them are not part of that combination. So it cycles through every possible combination, and it finds the correct answer. This example, you have five names on the left and five on the right. Five numbers on the left and five on the right. So now there's a merge going on and there's a fuzzy merge going on and a compare. So we have um, on the left and the right, we have Bill. On the left and the right, we have Doug. On the left and the right, we have Henry. On the left and the right, we have Brian and Brianna. Excel would not pick this up. It's a fuzzy match. There is a, a box that appears that will show that what kind of match it is, and it will show the difference between the two, and then James and James matches, and then it also shows the differences in the amounts. In this case, we're going to be tagging Brian and Brianna as a potential typo, and we can save that so that somebody else can look at this further later on. We can save this entire workspace to our desktop or to the cloud, to recall later by us or by somebody else, and eventually in a collaborative mode as well. This is actually a very interesting and powerful tool that kind of pulls things together that you've seen so far. Basically, it's a comparison again, but what you're doing now is you're seeing how multiple names for Denver, for example, can be matched up. So we have here um, David Enver and Denver and David Enver, and Dave Enver, and D Enver, and Dave and Sir, even though they don't match. But what it does is it finds that the totals match, 550 on this side, 450 on that side, 100, 200, 300, 400, it all totals 1,000. So it's using a lot of artificial intelligence and combinations to figure out how names match. There are built-in apps that will find built-in presets, so to compare Wells Fargo, against a QuickBooks account for reconciliation purposes. And you, it will guide you step by step. All these little apps can be customized so that users can be guided step by step. There's also artificial intelligence that will automatically recognize a Wells Fargo statement from a Chase statement, from a NetSuite um, accounting system to QuickBooks accounting system. There are other uh, built-in apps as well to speed things. And this feature, will show a statement of reconciliation, which is a little bit different from other reconciliations in that it stratifies the different transactions based on the quality of the matches. So a five-star transaction or a five-star match is a match that is perfect. Uh, a four-star is something less than perfect. A one-star obviously is very uncertain and the user can then go back and check it and look at the one stars and the two stars and the three stars, depending on how deep they want to go into it. So this is a unique type of reconciliation. There is a power tool that will cycle through every combination of columns 
to find perfect matches and near perfect matches. So in this case, this is for addresses, comparing two sets of addresses with name, phone, email, company, streets. So there's several columns, and it is figured out that 95 of the columns on the left match 95 on the right perfectly with every field. There's one row that doesn't match on street. There's one that doesn't match on name. There's one that doesn't match on email. This is uh, very unique and almost impossible to do in Excel. There's actually 3,431 combinations, and it cycles through all of them, and it did it in 17 seconds. All right, this is basically a search and replace on steroids because of two reasons. One, it finds near matches, so it knows Bricker McGee and Bricker McGee were spelled slightly differently um, or near matches and it highlights them. You just click on it and you select which way you want to go, replace one or the other, and it will toggle between the two, um, and you can click that to record it. Um, it also will um, do multiple, so you have D Moorhead, Dan, and Dan spelled different ways, and it will find all three, and you, again, you can replace it. But what's also unique is those replacements are saved permanently. So the data, every time you look at the same data, it will always be updated appropriately. Similar to what you saw before, this will now, the DDU tab, what this does is it will group them all together. So instead of having just a huge long list with color-coded backgrounds, it will group the uh, near matches together and you can select how you want to um, replace them. And it also shows you the differences between the two sets of uh, text, two or three sets of text. This is a little bit under the hood. This is showing calculated columns. There's a language that will help the user create columns based on the existing data. Now, the key is that the AI is really, for almost all intents and purposes, the only one that will create the data, but a user can actually create these columns by themselves. And over here, you'll see the language that's used. It's, it's somewhat natural language, but uh, it's pretty clear, and uh, it's very, very powerful. There are lots of ways to get data in and out of this product. So, for example, you can go to File and then save the workspace and then just load it. You can copy and paste data right into this text box, or you can open any kind of file, Excel, or a uh, other file directly from uh, your Windows system. And many more methods are coming, including uh, a lot of import-export directly from Excel, so there's tremendous flexibility, and one of the nice things about this product is that more features can be added very easily because it's delivered online. Um, another thing is this, these tables, they can be copied to the clipboard. They can go to CSV, Excel, et cetera, et cetera. It's, um, it's very flexible, and it, the flexibility is actually growing daily. Thank you for listening and watching, and please um, sign up to our website so you can get the latest information. There is a lot more good stuff coming and a lot better videos than this that are definitely uh, going to be on the uh, horizon.